We have all seen videos of bizarre flying objects that cannot be explained. These objects exhibit erratic movement and display characteristics impossible for our aircraft to match. But most of these alien objects are not caught on the camera's lens, making it difficult for observers to prove their case. However, this time, the proof is irrefutable as the footage comes straight from the International Space Station. What is the mysterious object the ISS has caught on camera? Is it an alien spaceship monitoring Earth from afar? Does NASA have an explanation for this bizarre flying object? Let's find out. The International Space Station, or ISS, is a modern marvel of engineering and global cooperation. But as astronauts from various nations advance research in space, some experts on Earth believe they've spotted aliens studying us. Are these claims baseless? Absolutely not. Let's take you back to March of 2017 when two astronauts were on a routine spacewalk to perform maintenance. Suspended 250 miles above the Earth's surface, flight engineer Peggy Whitson was filming their mission, but instead caught something unthinkable on her camera. She captured a strange object, which appeared to be otherworldly, spinning slowly as if to get a better view of something. Unlike usual sightings that last for mere seconds, this object was visible in the background for almost the entire seven-hour spacewalk. Peggy's video blew up social media as users began speculating about the origin of the strange object. Was it a UFO monitoring the Earth? This wouldn't be the first time alien hunters have asked this question. In 1998, NASA spotted a mysterious black object orbiting the Earth during the first space shuttle mission to the International Space Station. The strange entity was given the label STS-0887266 and classified as space junk. An astronaut who took part in that mission reported that the object was a wayward thermal blanket that broke loose while his team was trying to attach an American module to a Russian module on the ISS. However, many people didn't believe that story. Instead, they believe the strange black object is a 13000 year old artificially made satellite known as the Black Knight satellite. The tale of the Black Knight began with Nikola Tesla, who said he had received radio signals from space during his 1899 radio experiments in Colorado Springs. He believed the signals were an attempt made by Martians to communicate with human beings. Black Knight truthers think these radio pulses were sent from the same satellite. The theory that aliens were trying to communicate with Earthlings through radio pulsars propagated even further in 1927 when civil engineer and ham radio operator Jorgen Hald stumbled upon an unusual quality to his radio signals. Every time he would transmit from his home in Oslo, the signals would unexpectedly return to him moments later. Hald was convinced he was experiencing an alien phenomenon. A few years later, Time published a story noting that the U.S. Navy had detected an unidentified satellite that may have been a piece of Soviet spy technology. Although it was later written off as a broken piece of the Discoverer, an early U.S. photo reconnaissance satellite, it was hard for believers of the Black Knight controversy to accept the explanation. From Tesla hearing pulsars, Howells receiving an echo, and Time reporting on a secret U.S. government satellite, there was plenty of evidence that suggested an alien satellite was orbiting the Earth. It is believed the Black Knight avoids detection through a cloaking device that allows it to maintain its position without being spotted. Experts also say the alien satellite flies a very peculiar rotation around the Earth, from pole to pole. So, as the Earth spins in that direction, eventually, every continent will come underneath the spot where the Black Knight satellite is positioned. Coming back to the enormous object found floating near the International Space Station, it was seen floating through space, slowly turning on its own axis. Some observers saw this movement as a deliberate alignment to allow the object to observe the two astronauts better. Was the object the famed Black Knight satellite believed to be orbiting the Earth and gathering information about humans and their activities? Or was the object part of a UFO surveillance network, with the mothership far from sight? Let's analyze the footage closely. If you look at the spacewalk footage, you can see the object falling in the shadow of the space station at some points in the video. That shows the mysterious object is relatively small and close to the space station. 
So, perhaps it is one of the 130 million pieces of space junk circling the Earth. Believe it or not, the ISS sometimes has to maneuver out of the way to avoid being hit by that stuff. If it really were space junk, we would expect it to move across the surface of the Earth in a different direction, but it seems to be moving parallel to the ISS's motion. This is also one of the reasons NASA claims it cannot be an alien spying satellite. Not that it has accepted its existence, but that it's moving along with the ISS. If it were a spying satellite, it would follow a completely different trajectory from the ISS's orbit. Some experts say this particular object was a shield that was supposed to be installed, and the engineers accidentally dropped it. The shield was made of two-inch thick fabric meant to protect the ISS from strikes from space junk. Unfortunately, the official explanation sounds like the perfect cover-up, and alien hunters were quick to point that out. It was obvious that the flying object was artificially created not by humans, but by a highly developed extraterrestrial civilization. In fact, author Brad Olson also believes that this is just the tip of the galactic iceberg. According to Olson, aliens have been observing and monitoring our every move for decades. It's hard to deny the presence of a comprehensive UFO surveillance network across the globe. How else can we explain the numerous unidentified flying objects spotted in different parts of the world and now near the International Space Station? Now here's another picture that proves this theory. This image was taken by a British astronaut aboard the ISS in 2015. Here, three light sources can be seen moving in a coherent formation near the space station. What do you think these objects are? When this image was released, speculation ran really high across social media. However, the official explanation turned out to be quite anticlimactic. They said that the sources of light were not objects, but probably a liquid that leaked from the Russian sector of the International Space Station. When we say liquid, we mean urine shining brightly against the blackness of space. Can you believe that? There has always been considerable debate about whether or not extraterrestrials exist in our universe. From NASA scientists to governments around the world, everyone has accepted and reinforced the narrative that humans are one of a kind, and the circumstances in which Earth was created could not be replicated anywhere else in the cosmos. This is why they continue to deny UFO and alien sightings, no matter who reports them. However, keeping this secret under wraps was easier when people had little access to the latest technology. But things have changed now, and it's no longer possible to force a false narrative on the masses. Was the flying object spotted near the ISS an alien spacecraft? Maybe yes, and if it really was a UFO, does this mean aliens are constantly watching us? Why are they interested in humans and our activities? Is this surveillance connected to the fact that we're speeding toward our planet's destruction? After all, these UFO sightings have multiplied ever since the first nuclear attack on Hiroshima and Nagasaki, and many of these unidentified flying objects have been observed near military bases and nuclear silos. Some officers have even reported that an unseen hand stopped them from launching nuclear bombs. Could all this be interlinked? Are the aliens trying to protect us from ourselves? What do you think? Let us know your opinions in the comments section below. Remember to smash the like button if you enjoyed this video. Also, subscribe to our channel and press the notification bell for more thrilling space videos.